and learn about the unit circle with me. We like the radians and the degrees, but all these points, how can we find them? Well, let me help. I think I'll rhyme them. First, we have the fractions on the bottoms all twos. That's simple enough. You really can't lose. Now, here's a pattern I hope you can see. Just start at the top and follow my lead. First, go down. One, two, three. Then go up. One, two, three. You do the same on the left, you see. One, two, three, one, two, three. Now on the bottom, you just reverse it. It's three, two, one. Now let's rehearse it. Three, two, one, three, two, one, three, two, one, three, two, one. Hey! Now it's looking pretty full. There's just two more things we have to do. The twos and the threes on the top need a friend, and I'm not talking about a radian. We gotta add a radical symbol, better known as the square root. Let's add that to the twos and threes, then there's one more thing we have to do. Some of the numbers are negative, but quadrant one is all done. Just follow this rule, left, all right, and filling this in will be so much fun. Quadrant number two, the numbers on the left. Quadrant number three, that's all. Quadrant number four, just the numbers on the right, and now we have them all. Dance break, dance break. Dance, da, 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 dance break, dance break, dance break, dance, da, 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 dance break.